All right, we are on Virginia Tech's campus, and they have two new Otis elevators here. One's up there, one's over here. We're gonna ride up this elevator and then go check out that elevator. Let's see what kind these are. There's two of them back to back. We'll have to ride each one, I guess. Oh, it's glass. Brand new Otis elevator. These are quite nice. The door closed button works. Runs really well. Doesn't go up very high though. Since we're ending up at two, I'll switch elevators up there and let y'all see the floor indicator. Again, I like that the door closed button works. Send you back downstairs. There's only one call button. This right here is a testament to the quality of new elevators. We've tried calling it twice, and this one keeps coming, so that one's broken. Let's see if we have any better luck on these over here. This is crazy. I mean, two elevators. I mean, it is kind of cool. All right, let's see which one opens. Try this one. It's not much of a view, but I'm sure it gets better as we go up. Close button works. I mean, they run really well. They really do. That one actually has a screen on it, which we'll check out going up. We'll swap over up here. Here's our friend. We'll try to get that one. If that one doesn't work, maybe it's some weird power save mode or something. I like this one has the screen on. Let's send this one down and try to call this one. After that closes, please press the button. And that button is not at an ADA height. That is not ADA. Let's see if this one comes. Yeah, there, that, that one, the rear one is not responding on either bank, so I'm wondering if it's some weird power save mode. I have an idea. I want to try something. I have a feeling that back one is not glass. I'm going to try to send this one up and ring the elevator again and see if that one opens. Yep, it's just on some weird power save mode. So I take back what I said about the new elevators being junky. This one offers a different view. So you'd think the controller would dispatch this elevator if the other one's not there. Slow down in between floors. That was weird. Gonna end up on two. And it's off level. That's some sort of power save mode. Although I don't understand its logic. 
as we discovered up at the other bank, for some reason only this elevator responds to the call from up here, so we're going to go downstairs, send this one up, and then try to ring the other elevator. So I want to see what the view's like out of it. This indicator is kind of boring. Now this one will go up, and that one should open up when he presses the button. All right, Matt, go ahead and press the button once it goes. Yep. It's just some really interesting logic, I guess, to try to save power. So this elevator is not broken, and I take back what I said about these modern elevators being junk. I like the motor. Let's look at this indicator. It is boring. This elevator just did that same weird thing where it slowed down a little bit in between floors. So just ever so much, about halfway in between floors, you feel a bump and it slows down. But this is definitely an interesting set of elevators. Uh-oh, the video's over, but it doesn't have to be. You can always watch more, and you know what to do. And don't forget to subscribe and light up that bell. Until next time, bye, y'all.